happy today. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't look bad. It doesn't look good. Don't Hi, look everyone. <laughs> What'd you say? Don't look at mine. Oh, well, yours <laughs> always looks good to me. Hi, everyone. It's Nona Grace, and I'm from Western New York. Today, my strap shows. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> I'll make it disappear. Okay, it's gone. <laughs> <laughs> Today I'm so late. It's 7.30 and I usually am doing these videos at 6.30. In fact, I, I locked my chickens in right about now, which I just locked them in. But today I got lost in movies. I actually watched three movies and Jim came in, I guess, on time, but I didn't even notice that he came in. He gave me the mail. Was that when you came in? Or, no, no, that was before, but... And then he came, he went out and came back in, I guess, and I didn't even notice because I was involved in a movie. Yep. The movies, I, you know, I like Christmas movies, even though it's still early, but they're, they're very, very interesting to me. I enjoy watching them. And today I watched, uh, I watched Christmas for a Dollar. I watched the least of these. It's a Christmas story. I watched A Christmas Village. The one that I liked the best actually was The Christmas for a Dollar. The one, the first one I watched and I liked the last one. That one was good too. The one in the middle was okay. I like it when a movie can catch me right at the very beginning of the movie and I don't feel like I'm you know, wasting my time watching it. It's got my attention right away. Just like books. I like books to do that too. Within the first chapter they have to have me, otherwise I don't finish the book. I have some little video to put in, so we'll just put that in right here. Several years ago, Jim made me this flower press, and I've got probably something in it, but I don't know what's in it. But this is the press that he made. I was wanting to press flowers there for a while. And he made me this. And today I just went outside and was walking, and these are the leaves I gathered. They're really pretty. I'm going to press them. There's orange, yellow, burnt red, and a orangey, lighter yellow, and a green. But there's different shades of all the colors. I thought that was pretty nifty. And so I will put them in the press and see how they work. He put wing nuts and washers on it to make it easy for me to undo. And so now I'm going to open it up and we're going to see what's inside. On the other side I've got a, a little nut, a washer, and a peg. And I take them out. And I'm going to lift and see what's in here. I want to have cardboard. Maybe there's nothing in it. I don't know. For padding. Another cardboard for padding. Newspaper. When was this penny saver? October 2001. It's old. Penny saver. Oh, there's more underneath. Oh my goodness, I've got lots of stuff here. There's more petals. These kind of kept their color. And part of a flower. I've got quite a bit in here. Wow. And some leaves. I was really into pressing flowers at one time, apparently. I was making pictures is what I was doing in frames. I saw a lady do a bird one time. Oh wow, this is, this, they must be like the shumac tree. There's more. Wow, wait, I've got a lot of, lot of leaves here. My goodness gracious me. And there's a maple leaf. Well, I put my leaves inside this press, and I'll leave them probably for a very long time. I've tightened it down. As you can see, he put a washer here, and a nut here, and a wing nut here, and I can go very fat if I had to, but I don't need to. I put the papers back inside that were in there because it seemed to do a good job, and boy, now I've got a mess galore. Here's all those leaves. And the flowers, they're on my counter now. So now I'm going to take them and glue them and make a picture of some sort. I don't know what kind of picture I'm going to make, but I'm going to try. The whole idea of wanting to dry flowers came from these pictures that I got from Dale. It was when I had my daycare. She dried some flowers and made a beautiful little arrangement with them. My mom and dad. My mom and dad again. This is when they're in their everyday clothes. And this is when they're dressed up. And that's little Emily. Isn't she adorable? That was when she was in daycare with me. Here are my creations. 
They're kind of pretty. They're glaring because I've laminated them. It was hard to laminate underneath. And this one I'm going to fussy cut around a little bit. This one is going to stay as is. And this one, I tried to put through the thing and it, you notice that the laminator caught that and broke it. But other than that, this one is quite pretty too. I like them and I've got all these left over that will be just put into the compost because I'm not going to use them. Well, I cut a lot of it away to make it more realistic. I went outside for a little bit. It's colder today and it was raining quite a bit on and off. But when I went out, it wasn't raining. I looked at my steps and thought, gosh, I better get some steps in. So I went outside, but I didn't stay out very long because I found the leaves. And then I decided to put them in my press. And so that's what my, my afternoon was, monkeying with the leaves. <laughs> it kills me when I say monkey, and I think of mm -hmm. the girls from Austria because they, they didn't understand monkey. And monkey what? And I was fiddling. And then I said fiddling, and they didn't understand that. And it was like, oh, my goodness, how am I? I said, just go into the store. And what I was doing was trying to fix the door on the van at the time. But anyways, I did the leaves, and I show you what I did with them. Now I'm done talking, and this is awfully long, so I hope you had something to drink or eat with this video, and I'll see you all tomorrow. Take care. Bye-bye.